We have determined that you play from- Oh no, no! Cancel! Hello everybody and welcome to Promise Gaming and Steamed, the series where I try out the games in my Steam library that I bought but never had a chance to play. And today we're trying out 911 Operator, where you play as the operator of the 911 emergency hotline and try to direct emergency services to those in need in your city. I'm actually trying this now because uh, I did get a very nice request from one of my viewers and I said, all right. All right, we'll go ahead and give it a shot. So let's play in, oh, there's a lot of different cities. Albuquerque? Albuquerque seems kind of fun. Let's play over here. One fun thing about this game is it actually shows you a whole bunch of little first aid things. Like, I think it'll give me the continue option, but it gives you like actual helpful information. Cardiopulmonary resuscitation, DRS, ABCD action plans, poisoning, car accidents. Here's like all the instructions to do and what not to do. It's actually educational if you want to spend the time reading it. Ah, well. So, here is my current squad. We have... On oh, bikes? Oh, you guys are awesome. We have a bunch of police. Uh, we have three ambulances and two fire trucks. I don't feel like that's enough fire trucks, but for the time being, we'll make this work. I need money in order to buy other equipment. $100,000 for a fire vehicle and so on. It's pretty pricey. Why I am responsible for city funding as a 911 operator, I'll never know. Let's go ahead and start the deployment. Here is the city of Albuquerque, in my region that I have to protect. My gosh, it's massive. Here we go! Waiting for an emergency to happen. If you patrol around and stuff, sometimes you find problems. There's an incident right here. A biting, a dog has bitten a person. Alright, send the bite cops and send the ambulance. There's a need for medical assistance in 240 Indian School Road, Northwest. Indian School Road? Huh. In uh, Goodyear, Arizona, where I lived for a while, there's a place called Indian School Road. Under fire? Under fire from a dog? You should be fine. Up, ah, We got a fire! Quickly! Send the fire truck! What kind of a fire is this? An electrical hazard. Okay. You can't seriously be under fire from a dog. I mean, yes, a person got injured by a dog, but he sh he'll be fine. We got a new call! 911, what's your emergency? Calm down, sir. Where are you? What's the address you're calling from? <laughs> sir, what what's happening there? My, my daughter! My daughter! You're not answering the question, sir. What happened? What happened to your daughter, sir? Why did you... Why did you do that? My little girl... Oh, okay. Okay, this is sad. This is actually very sad. Um, check her pulse. Okay, sir, we're gonna get ambulance on the way. Have you checked her pulse? Yes! Yes! There's no pulse! There's no pulse! She doesn't have a heartbeat! Her heart stopped! Do I need to know any more information at this point? Do you know what happened to her? I'll send a patrol there. Please stay where you are and try not to move or touch anything. <laughs> Seriously, quality voice acting right there. Not half bad. Huh. Alright, so over here we need to have a police transport to actually go pick up the dog, apparently, because bikes aren't good enough. Hey, what happened to my extra, um, fire station? Didn't I have another one? I thought I did, but now apparently we have another... Oh, it's a cat in a tree. I'll assist you if I can, but really the cat in a tree is not a priority over an electrical fire. That's just ridiculous. So we're starting off really heavy right now. I mean, obviously this is extremely sad. Oh, it's got like a little remember thing here too. More fires! Alright, at this point I'm just gonna say... You need to wait. Um, where exactly are my other... I was... Oh, there it is! Found it! Okay, I knew there was supposed to be another truck somewhere. Just hiding way down there for some reason. Criminals in prison. From an electrical hazard. Ah, yes. Remember, people. Always maintain your electronics. And do not let the electricity get anywhere near water. You could be held liable for burning down your own property. Alright, so let's see. Over here we have a situation report. Somebody got injured. 
and they are on their way to the hospital. So you can already see a lot of how this game works. You're managing your various different emergency response vehicles. Uh, you are available, I think, for something new. Um, manage, managing the different response vehicles, your intention, if you can, is to, well, maintain a good reputation with the city. But first we have to deal with a 911 call. 911, what's your emergency? My car was stolen! Where did this happen? In the middle of the street! While I was standing at a red light, he just dragged me out of my car and drove away! What's the address of where this happened, sir? It happened at... Okay. Send the bike cops! They can handle it! When was your car stolen? Just now! I've seen those thieves driving away in my car! Send somebody to catch them! Okay, I'm gonna need your license plate. Can you give that to me, please? It's... Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Nondescript. What color is your car? Purple. What type of car is it? Just average family sedan. So how many suspects did you see? It's hard to say. It all happened really fast. I wasn't aware what was going on. We're notifying the officers in the area now. They'll see if they can find your car. Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, cool. You can actually see that this guy is moving off the ramp, so we have to, like, intercept these guys. Oh, that's nifty. Alright, let's see if we can intercept this way. I want him to throw those, like, spikes on the highway and flip the car. Flip it so good! Alright, what's going on over here? Uh, we have a couple of different incidents. We have, oh, a sharp tool injury. Send the ambulance. Uh, situation report. Somebody's getting arrested. Whoa, what's happening over here? There's a building on fire. Okay, you know what? The cat can wait. Sorry, cat's not important. Building's on fire. Way more important. Somebody is taking damage. They are under fire. Okay, sent you that way. Did somebody die? I don't know, this incident appears to have resolved itself. I'm guessing the person died. Oh good, we have someone trapped in an elevator too. Okay, well I'm working on it. I'm working on it, gosh dang it, the city is so demanding! Albuquerque, the crud is wrong with you. Now the thing is, I know that like these guys uh, in, in emergency response, they're always under a lot of pressure. Working pretty fast and there's so many competing priorities, so many people that need attention desperately. Case in point, not uh, terribly long ago, when there was, um, by the way, we're going to send some extra police officers over here since apparently they're under fire still. Uh, back in the day, when my wife was uh, accidentally uh, wrecked her car, we had to replace the darn thing because there was a huge snowfall in Virginia. Uh, she had to wait for like five hours before people were able to get her out because the police were so busy with other calls. Speaking of which... 911, what's your emergency? Hello? There's an unconscious man here on the pavement. Where are you calling from? Okay, uh, let's send an ambulance. Is he breathing? Yes. Breath smells so bad. Probably been drinking, right? I'm guessing he'd be drinking. Any injuries? Does he have any visible injuries? No, I think he's not injured. What kind of an incident is this real quick? Speeding? Ah, bike cops can handle that one. Sorry, um, I'll send the police. I'm gonna send a police officer to check up on him as well, okay? Wait there until he arrives. Okay, I'm waiting. Thank you very much, sir. You are a responsible citizen. I mean, he may smell terrible and all- Oh gosh, there's so many other things going on. Okay, hang on. Ambulance, down here. Or what is this? Family abuse, childbirth. Well, childbirth seems important. Help the new babies. Uh, apparently that's- Drunk man is already done? I guess he's not really injured, we just needed the police to arrest him. Okay. Uh, are we done with this incident up here yet? No, there's so much going on. Alright, hang on. I need- I need- I need one of you guys to back up and go back over here to a- What is this? A loud party. Well, at least there's no guns involved. That does happen. Sometimes you get into shootouts with people, and, uh, well, obviously that is a bit hazardous for your peeps. Oh my gosh, there's even more happening here. Okay, do we even need... I don't think we need any more... Okay, we're gonna send the police and the ambulance over here. Spotted building on fire. I've already got the firemen here. There should be nothing else going on. I'll send the second one to go and assist. Maybe speed that up just a wee little bit. What's going on now? What is it? Okay, it's still the childbirth. Hold on, keep that baby inside of you! The ambulance is on the way! Man, I feel like I'm really making some sort of a difference here. Uh, okay, wait, crap, where are you going? Ah, uh, okay, send the bike cops. Beating? Oh, wait, we're, we're gonna need some reinforcements for this. Send someone over there. Need backup. Under fire? What? 911, what's your emergency? Um, yeah, hello. I don't really know how to say it, but... 
Yes. I think my husband's a cook. Uh, what do you mean? I'm sorry, what do you mean, ma'am? I, I mean, I think he makes drugs. Oh. Ah, all right. Uh, why do you think so? Well, I found weird containers filled with some stuff in our cellar, and they stink pretty bad. I have no idea what it is. My husband's a chemist, but why would he need that? Um... That's not enough evidence, ma'am. But he's in touch with some kid. I, I guess his former student... Oh my gosh, this lady's been watching way too much Breaking Bad. I'm not sure, but it might have been connected to drugs. Why do you call 911 on your husband? We don't get along well, and I feel like my home is being observed lately. Some shady guy started to wander around in our neighborhood. I'm scared. I need to protect my son. In that case, you should go to the nearest police station and talk to an officer there. Bring some photos of the labels that are on the containers, okay? Okay. Thank you. Oh my gosh, there's so much going on. How am I supposed to be even able to handle all these beatings? What is wrong with you people in this city? Oh, speed up, speed up. You may not be able to deal with abs- Oh gosh. You may not be able to deal with absolutely everything in this game. Entirely possible that some things will get left behind. Concerned wife. I'm pretty sure I said to ignore you, so we're not going to send anybody. Oh good, the fire stuff's finally done. You go here. You guys start patrolling up this direction, because I'm pretty sure something's going to happen eventually. Requesting backup. Spotted the beating, and you're under fire, because everyone's got a gun in Albuquerque. Ah! What is happening in this place? New calls. What's your emergency? There's a fire here. Where? 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 Are where? You, sir? In front of. So what's on fire? I guess it's a living room. I need you to be more specific, sir. Is the room in a house or an apartment? It's situated in an apartment building. Is the fire spreading anywhere? I don't think so. You're not inside, are you? No, I saw the fire through a window. All right, so how big is the fire? Pretty big. The flames are shooting up 10, maybe 15 feet. Yikes. The fire department is on the way. Okay. Oh, well, he just ends it there. I just wanted to let him know that we're taking this seriously. I wasn't really saying, hey, you just forget it. Hang up. I was just letting him know. I'm taking your complaints very seriously, sir. Emergency services are on their way. Oh, good, we got a drunk driver. Let's quickly save him before he hits somebody, because that could happen. You. Oh, wait, no. You go here. Um, you. Uh, go here. We're under fire. Send back up. Ah! There's too much happening here. The vandals are violent. What about the childbirth? Have you given birth yet? Gosh dang it, woman. Get that baby outside of you. All right, we're sending the criminals to prison right now. You have to actually deliver people to the hospital and stuff eventually. They do automatically try to do that if that is uh, an option. We have some backup over here. One of the uh, villains is arrested. One is injured. The other is still at large. And we have a couple of injured female officers. Please freaking... Ah! All right, fine. Send some more guys. I think we're just finishing out the night at this point, and then that's going to be it. We should be more or less done. Oh, he smokes. This city? I don't like this city. I am never going to Albuquerque at this point because... Apparently something happens every 10 minutes, and everyone's got a gun! There's never enough fire trucks. The sharp tool injury did time out, which ruins my uh, reputation a little bit. We also had an epilepsy attack, which I didn't even see. Childbirth? I was sitting there at childbirth. Why didn't you give- why didn't you let me inside? I don't get it. Alright, whatever. We ended up walking away with pretty good reputation. 30 reputation. There's our base income. We get $30,000 as rewards, which ain't half bad. Some fines. There's our salaries going out and total profits. Okay, wonderful. So let's go back, and now we can assign some more team members. Do I want more vehicles? Let's see, medical transport, ambulance, police cars, bikes, and so on. Kind of depends. It seems to me like bike cops aren't going to be good enough because, uh, well, it's pretty violent. We have an extra fire truck, apparently. So what if I bring you over? Can I bring you over there? Wait, staff, vehicles, equipped for firefighting. But I need more firefighters. That's something I need. Hang on. So let's see. We are going to hire a really good firefighter and put you here. Okay. You could use some extra assistance. So let's bring another cop. And uh, they are... You're not armed. Hang on. We need to give you a gun. How about a pistol? 
And you guys are going to get bulletproof vests because you appear to be in a bigger car, so I'm assuming you're my SWAT team. I could use someone else running the ambulance, too. First aid kits. Probably don't need those in ambulances. I'm assuming they already have those. So let's have these guys be our first responders with these. Uh, I could give guns to other people. Can I give guns to the firefighters? Is that an option? Ha <laughs> ha, no. Okay, well that was a little too much to hope for. How about an extra driver for this final ambulance? And let's start the deployment in Albuquerque once again! Ah! Alright, I think we're spread out pretty well. I know where everyone is this time. I can't zoom the camera out any further, so it's going to be very easy to miss things. We have to watch that new incident map thing. Alright, bring on the incidents! I'm ready for you this time, Albuquerque. Oh, we have a fire. Quickly, let's just go ahead and send both of them, since they got nothing else to do. Might as well put out the chemical hazard even faster. Heck, I could even send some cops and try to arrest somebody. Maybe. Need firefighters. Oh, we need an ambulance. Go, go, go. An epilepsy attack. I'm ready for it this time. New call. 911, what's your emergency? Hi, I'd like to report two arguing men. They're shouting and pulling each other's clothes. I'm worried they will start fighting any moment. Classic public disturbance. Where are they? Okay, where are you calling from? It's the car wash at... <laughs> Send the armed cops. Can you tell if they have any weapons? I don't know. Hurry, it's getting violent. Okay, uh, do you know them? Do you know either of these men? No, I have no idea who they are. Haven't seen them here before. They scared all of my customers off. Have you tried to calm them down? Don't, don't... Uh, Oh, that, that's going to get her targeted. Are you there, sir? I think they don't want to meet any policemen. They're running to a car. Great. Can you tell the make and model of the car? A uh, black SUV. They're driving oh. away. Oh, okay. It's now, it's now a high-speed chase. What's the plate number? Were you able to get a license plate number? Not really. I don't see well. Okay, make and model. Do you know the make or model of the SUV they left in? No, sorry. Okay, uh, how do they, well, well, let's see. How do they Can look? you tell me what the men look like? Are they white, black, Hispanic? Profile! Both are white and tall, wearing dark clothes. I understand. I'll have officers keep a lookout for them. Okay, bye. Alright, let's go patrolling. Sooner or later, we actually can find them. Potentially. What is this? Red light offense. That's not what I was looking for. Ha-ha! Go here. What is this? A family abuse. Send extra backup. I don't want just bike cops for that one. It's not gonna be good enough. Okay, so there's the- oh wait, this is the car wash shop. Well, good. Uh, we have a building on fire. Cool. I can handle that. Uh, you're done here? Okay, so I guess you don't need to deliver anyone to the hospital. Oh, I have to worry about going across the river! Well, good thing I had a second truck ready to go. We're done over here. Beautiful! You guys are doing an amazing job. I'm very proud of every single one of you. You are a true model citizen. Uh, you, go and assist with a sharp tool injury. New call! 911, what's your emergency? Crap! Where are you calling from? <laughs> okay. What's on fire? The counter! I accidentally threw a cloth on the burner! And the fire spreads quickly! Okay, um... Okay, do you have a fire extinguisher? No! How can you not have a fire extinguisher?! Okay, I want you to stay calm. Carefully cover the fire with a damp towel. This may be dangerous. I can't help. What should I do? Throw okay. water all over Get it! Get yourself and anyone else that's in the house out of the house now. The fire department will be there soon. Okay. Okay, we're gonna send the police just to kind of protect. Oh God, there's even more crap. I need. Ah, this guy's trapped in an elevator. I'm sorry. We have to leave you alone for now. Someone call a mechanic. That's a more important job. Another building is on freaking fire. Ah! There's always so much to do. Okay, where's my other... Didn't I have a... Okay, so you're finished with that. You go up here. We're putting out that fire. Oh my god, what's with all the buildings on fire? Albuquerque is burning tonight! Okay, send an extra ambulance over there. Um, we're already dealing with that. Uh, you go over here, we have a car bump. That sounds like a job for the bike cops, if I'm being honest. Save the main cops for something that actually matters. Calls? 911, what's your emergency? Factory. One of my employees got stabbed by a sharp tool. Oh, good lord. What's the address you're calling from? Okay. What exactly happened to your employee? He fell off a ladder and stabbed himself with a knife while falling. 
Are you in danger? Do you need police assistance? Police? Uh, no, no, no police. We just need an ambulance. All right, working on it. I understood. I'll send an ambulance there. I understood, okay. but I asked stupid questions the first time. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, we clearly need more vehicles. Gosh dang it, it's like Albuquerque is intent on dying. Ah! Okay. Uh, you go here. Um, no, go here. Um, you finished here? Perfect. Go and hey, deal with this building on fire. Um, why is this building still not dealt with? Gosh dang it, what is wrong with you people? I didn't actually want to send an officer over here. That was an accident. What's this? Trapped in an elevator. There's a lot of buildings on fire tonight, though. Sorry, guys, trapped in elevators. Oh, crap. You, get down here. We have a car bump. It's a little bit overkill, but whatever. Uh, so these people are going to the hospital. You're going to be going here. Pick somebody else up. Gosh, dang it! 911, what's your emergency? Hey, there was a robbery. Okay, where? Where did this happen? Okay, um, when? How long ago did this happen? A few minutes ago. Okay, are you okay? Do you have any injuries? Yes, my friend is injured. Okay. What happened to your friend? They knocked him down. He's hurt and having breathing problems. Crap. Okay, just make sure he doesn't move until the ambulance arrives. Sure. Are your attackers still in the area? I have no idea. They ran away somewhere. Did they have any weapons? No, I think not. All right, sir. We'll take care of it. Just wait for emergency services to arrive. Yeah, I will. Okay. Oh my gosh, we're working on it. Okay, we're gonna deliver some people who are from the building. Firefighters still haven't arrived because this idiot is still not done. Finally. Gosh. Go there. There's another building on fire. Oh my god. It's impossible. This is impossible. This whole city will burn! I am trying so hard not to get people killed, but I can't help them! They're intent on death! Every one of them are arsonists! 911, what's your emergency? Send people here, now! And <laughs> okay, sir, what happened? A plane has crashed into a house. Whoa, what? Plane crashes into a house? Okay, drinking in public, not Hello? nearly as important. What type of plane? A large one or a small one? A small one. Two-seater, I guess. Okay. Can you tell if there's anyone inside the house? No. Uh, a woman ran outside. She, she said she was alone and she's not injured. But I, I can tell she's in deep shock. Okay. Is anything on fire? Of course it is. There's some smoke coming out of the rooftop, but I can't see the flame. That doesn't mean that it doesn't is exist. There else there oh, God. Injured? I'm not sure. I can't see them. Oh my god. Okay, any uh, help is on the okay. way. Emergency you already said that there's a the survivor. There soon. I can't Hurry. respond fast enough. What is wrong with these stupid firefighters? They're all injured. Every one of them's getting horribly, horribly injured from the fires. Ah. Uh, uh, new incidents. More buildings on fire. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Electrical hazards. Electrical hazard, or is it actually on fire? Because if it's not on fire, it's not my problem. Holy crud, though. Drug dealer. Oh, good. We have guns, at least, so we'll be ready to deal with that one. Let's try to deal with the building on fire and get those people out of there. Uh, wait. We need something over here. A pedestrian was hit by a freaking thing. You know what? Let them burn. Let them learn their lesson. The building is gone. The building is gone. Apparently, that's been dealt with. You guys, can you get over here? Okay, the building is on fire still, but at least that's done. Freaking firefighters! I have so much less respect for the Albuquerque fr Fire Department at this point. I mean, I know it's all just a silly simulation, but holy crud, though. Dang! I actually have less, I just have less respect for the people of Albuquerque in general after this. Freaking stop setting your city on fire, and I don't think we're going to have any problems, you know? I'm not worried about the electrical hazard right now. I'm aware medical transport is needed. I am sending them on the way. Okay, we finally dealt with something over there. Let's go deal with that building on fire. What's happening here? Oh, you need everything. You need everything, do you? You know what? This building's been on fire for a while. Let's go ahead and let them freaking die. Just let them freaking die at this point. Let's deal with the plane crash. That seems like a lot more fun, personally. Okay, it's just fires everywhere. Fires, fires, freaking everywhere. Can you assist them in some way? 
keep people away from the burning building, get them to actually do their dang jobs. They're losing health at a pretty uh, rapid rate, which I'm very concerned about. So fine, let's go ahead and send them. Uh, we are no longer have any problems as far as fire is concerned there. Fire station, go here. Okay, we got this building on fire still. So we'll put that out while we can. Do I have to just deal with all these incidents or just wait until they're all finished at this point? Because this is going to take forever. Well, it does not appear that having an ambulance at the side of the fire assists the firemen in any particular way. Maybe the issue really is not even just about having more vehicles. It's that you really need to have fully staffed fire vehicles. Two people alone can hardly do the job, apparently. I don't know, but gosh dang, this is proven to be a little bit rough. So this really does make me think, though. Like, what happens for 911 operators when you actually have too many competing options? Like, what do you do? You just have to pick and choose which ones get resolved and which ones die? I don't know. But, I mean, it sure not doesn't look good to the city if uh, if uh, some people die because you couldn't get there fast enough. Can you imagine the headlines? People are like, this person could have been saved if only the police or the firefighters have arrived on time. They would have not bled out to death. Something. I don't freaking know. Very frustrating. Are we actually resolving this faster? Yeah, two trucks resolve things very fast. So maybe it's just about having four people together. I don't know. Golly gosh dang though, at least we got some pretty substantial rewards, which means I have enough money to actually do something useful. Promote it to the next city. Well that sounds fantastic, but I don't think we have time for that in this video. Chicago? Oh, I think Chicago is going to be a heck of a lot harder than Albuquerque. I think I'll pass on that one, thank you very much. This is a pretty fun game. I like the priority management aspect of it, and it really does put you on the spot, feeling like you have to actually uh, expand your abilities because you just can't get to everybody. Makes me really think about the people who actually do these kinds of jobs. If you know your public servicemen, dang it all, treat them well and with respect because they have a hard enough life as it is. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If so, then be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.